Utilizing technology to pave the way for the future. Centered on developing a hydrogen business and using cutting-edge battery EV technology. Welcome everyone in today's video. We're going to look at Toyota new CEO announced new hydrogen cars. Under the banner, let's change the future of cars. Toyota Motor Corporation recently organized a technical briefing session called Toyota Technical Workshop and unveiled a number of new technologies that would help its transformation into a mobility company. But before we proceed the further video, if you're new to this channel, remember a go ahead to hit the bell icon to subscribe so you won't miss the informative videos we will upload in the future. The future of auto production was discussed by Hiroki Nakajima, Executive Vice President and Chief Technological Officer, along with Toyota's technology plan. Additionally, he discussed a range of distinct technologies, including ideas that are still in development, that will aid in realizing the vision and guidelines that have been previously conveyed. Takeru Katuyo, who has been named president of the recently founded BEV factory, and Mitsumasa Yamagata, who will be named president of the hydrogen factory when it opens in July, both gave speeches as well. They went into greater detail about their own business plans for hydrogen and battery electric vehicles. At the policy briefing in April, the Toyota Mobility concept was explained. The three strategies of electrification, intelligence, and diversification are those that contain the key to its implementation. We will continue to pursue a multi-path approach in the area of electrification, which includes the introduction of the best powertrains for every location. In the field of intelligence, we will also support programs to strengthen our ties with society, like Woven City, in addition to cars and services. We'll also keep increasing the scope of our business beyond cars to encompass society which will include everyone's access to freedom of movement and a variety of energy sources. Since 2016, when the firm system was launched, we have been transferring resources to advanced development fields and actively investing in future-oriented regions to promote these three technological topics. By March 2023, we had increased the overall amount while moving more than half of our recental and roughly half of our expenditures to advanced development domains. In the future, we'll speed up this trend even more. Next Generation Battery, EV Strategy, the goal of BEV Factory, a battery EV organization established in May, is to reform the automotive, manufacturing, and workplace industries in order to influence the future with BEVs. We will attain a vehicle cruising range of 1000 km on the vehicle axis using technologies like the combination of next generation batteries and sonic technology. Aerodynamic performance is backed by AI to deliver more stylish design, and designers will concentrate on expressing natural sensibility. The options for enjoying cars will be endlessly expanded with the RE nose and full oat with innovations that can only be developed by a car manufacturer. We will provide our consumers with thrilling surprises and excitement, just like the manual EV. The car body will be built on the production line using a revolutionary modular design and three primary parts. Adopting mega casting will enable significant component integration, which helps to save manufacturing investment and vehicle development costs. Self-propelling production technology will also cut the investment in processes and plants in half. A all-in-one team with a single CEO, the BEV factory unites departments and regions outside of the purview of a manufacturer, including woven by Toyota and other partners, with everyone on the same site and aware of the problems. This one team will transform the way work is done and enable swift decision-making and first response. We will release a complete portfolio of next-generation BEVs in 2026 and we will roll them out internationally. BEV Factory will supply 1.7 million units out of a total of 3.5 million by 2030. We are determined to lead the globe in battery EV energy usage, so the following generation of battery EVs will use new batteries. To surpass client expectations and ensure profits, we shall enhance our product attractiveness using the resources we earn. A car maker produced battery. EV that excites the hearts of all customers is something to look forward to. Hydrogen Business Strategy The fuel cell market is anticipated to grow quickly in the years leading up to 2030, reaching a level of 5 trillion yen per year. 
with the hydrogen markets in Europe, China, and North America being by far the largest. We are supporting the external sale of fuel cells made with the hydrogen units from the Mirai, and proposals have been made for 100,000 external sales by 2030. The majority of them are trucks. We will create a new company named Hydrogen Factory in July to be able to make quick decisions under one leader from sales to development and production all at once. In response to the market's rapid changes, three axes will be used by the Hydrogen Factory to enhance business, localizing RWT and production in nations that are part of the key markets is the first step. We'll step up our efforts by building regional hubs, primarily in China and Europe. The second is solidifying partnerships with influential partners. By combining appropriate quantities through partnerships, we shall try our best to provide our clients with fuel cells that are reasonably priced. Technology and competition make up the third. Next generation cell technologies and FC systems are only a few examples of the competitive next generation FC technologies we'll be working on. As we advance these initiatives, we'll strive toward full-scale commercialization. Through technical advancement, volume efficiency, and localization, the next generation system will reduce costs by 37. In addition, working with our partners, if an offer for 200,000 units comes in 2030, we will be able to cut costs by 50, turn a healthy profit, and yet meet the demands of our various clients and governments to accomplish this. We'll collaborate on development, production, and sales. By setting up bases with a focus on customers in important areas and providing reasonably priced products in adequate quantities, we will take the relationships we have developed with reliable partners as an opportunity to speed up our efforts to commercialize hydrogen. That's all for today's video. In addition, hydrogen continues to be exceedingly expensive. Toyota will continue to collaborate with its partners to contribute to the production, transportation, and use of hydrogen in order to encourage its broad adoption. Don't forget to like the video and hit the subscribe button so you don't miss any new videos from our channel. Thanks for watching and see you all soon.